All right, guys, today we're gonna try something totally different. We're gonna try to program some keys for a Jeep Wrangler. When we got the Jeep, we only had one key. We ordered two off the internet. And today we're gonna try to program them to this Jeep. So you guys, come on. So here's what I got. This is the key that came with the Jeep. It's the factory key. Um, I called a local place and they wanted $185 for one of these keys and program it to the Jeep. I thought that was a little ridiculous. So I decided, hey, let's see if we can't do it ourselves. So we ordered both of these keys off of eBay for like 20 bucks. We took them to the local Walmart. They cut the keys to match this key. Obviously they're not programmed. The Jeep dealership wanted $80 a key to program them. And I was like, nah, so we're gonna try something. We've got the Matco Maximus 3.0 scanner here that we're gonna try to use to program this. Um, I did have to get the security code from one of my buddies that works for Jeep and he was able to give me the four digit code. Matco says it'll work with that code. So the first thing we're gonna do is plug up the dongle, turn the ignition key on. All right, so I think we're in the right spot here. We went under um, wireless control module, program ignition keys. So let's see if that'll work. It's asking for the personal identification number. And that's what we just entered. So let's see what's gonna happen. Place unprogrammed key into the ignition and turn key to the run position. So that's the factory one. We'll put the first one in, run position, and hit OK. Programming key, please wait. Programming key was successful. Continue the program. Another key, otherwise exit the program. Cycle the ignitions for 45 seconds prior to starting the vehicle. So we're gonna take that one out. We're gonna program our next one in. Programming of the ignition was successful. Cycle the ignition off for 45 seconds prior to starting the vehicle. So we're gonna hit okay. Then we're gonna hit cancel. I'm gonna stop communications with it. I'm actually gonna exit 
back out of the scan tool and we're just going to check it and see. So the second unprogrammed key that I have is in the ignition now. So I'm gonna turn it off. We're gonna leave it for 45 seconds. And hopefully it'll work. I guess we can test the lock. Well, it locked and unlocked. So that's a good sign. The other key, unlocked, locked. So it's working and the factory key they're working so let's see if it will start the vehicle awesome no ignition lights no check engine lights none of that stuff so that key appears to be working properly and the next key yeah. And it's working. So that's awesome. So it's definitely 100% for sure that you can order these keys off of eBay. Like I say, it was less than $20 for the two keys. Have them cut. If you know a guy that's got the Maximus 3.0 by Matco Tools or the Maximus 4.0, they can do it. You see, it's really easy. You just scan the vehicle like you're normally going to. You go to system functions. You go to the wireless module. Um, I think it's like wireless module WMPS and it says tires on it, but that's the same thing that works your tire pressure monitoring system it's in here. But it's that simple. You go to it, you hit the button, it's going to come up just like it showed. It's going to ask you to enter your PIN. You enter your PIN, you take your factory key out, put your first program key in, let it do its thing, hit OK, hit your second one, and you're done. So that's it, guys. That's how easy it is to program your Jeep keys without spending a ton of money. And there you go. Matco did a great job on this scanner, does a lot of cool stuff. So if you guys are in the market for a scan tool, be sure to check those out from Matco because you just seen it saved a ton of money. Like always, guys, thanks for watching. If you liked the video, be sure to hit that thumbs up. Check over here for merchandise. Cool tools and discount codes are down here in the description. If you're not subscribed, it's really, really easy. You take your finger, you press the button. You can't get any better than that. So you guys have a great week, and we will catch you later. See ya.